Okay, I've got it. Just stay right where you are, okay? We're coming to rescue you. You hear me? <laughs> Don't give up. All right, hello there. I am Scarecrow J, and we are back with some more Michigan report from hell. We're getting right into it here. Daka TV team log. X goes so slow. Uh, it, it, that date. Uh, received information on a possible survivor in the Chicago International Hotel downtown. 8-23-10-23. Arrived at International Hotel. Filling in for Pamela Martell, because she's dead as hell. News reporter Ann Anderson. That's a good name. That's a good TV name. Sound engineer Jean-Philippe Briscoe. And moi, who I'm not named for some reason. Searched hotel, but didn't find any survivors. All we found was evidence that some gruesome incident had occurred. Okay, guess we're going to learn about a gruesome incident. That gruesome incident is the wasting of all this food. No. Okay, let's, uh, what, what, what can we see about this? Okay. All oh, right, I have to press the button again. <laughs> the fruit is starting to rot. See, it is going to waste. Ugh. God damn it. Oh, yes, look at the, the jaggedness of outside. What is going on outside? What is with the textures? Things are just like... They're not actually there. Okay. Whatever. Oh. Blood. There's a blood stain here. It must have been a really gruesome incident. There it is. <laughs> we found it. <laughs> that was fast. Oh god, this is pretty bad. Oh, is this a new reporter? Hi. Hopefully you don't die super fast like the other one. Find anybody in that room? Nope. Nobody in this room either. What a bloody mess, huh? All right, let's give up here. What was that inflection? There isn't anybody left in the whole hotel. Looks like it was just a false lead. Frisco went downstairs a long time ago. And anyway, the other teams are getting the jump on us. We don't have time to waste hanging around here. We've got to get out there and find something. So bizarre to me. Huh? The telephone. A telephone. Could it be Briscoe? Why would they be calling a random hotel room? Oh, I want to. I want to discover more. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello. How did you get this number? I can hear you. Calm down. Slow down. No, no. <laughs> I'm not your mother. Voice. It's like she doesn't know, like, inflection at all. I can't hear you very well. Wait! Don't hang up! Where are you? The center building! The observation deck! The observation deck of the center building? Is there anybody else there with you? Okay, I've got it. Just stay right where you are, okay? We're coming to rescue you. You hear me? <laughs> Don't give up. We're coming, I promise. Do you understand? It's like she's she taunting up. her. What is that? I. <laughs> There's a survivor in the center building. Let's go. Okay, so... Maybe we can get some leads on what's going on. In the last episode, I talked more about... Importantly, oh, she's still talking. Somebody's in trouble. Risco should be downstairs. Let's hurry. I, I want to explore first, okay, lady? Okay. <clears throat> I said in the last episode the voice acting was bad, and there were some examples in the last episode you probably witnessed, but they weren't that bad. This is very bad. Inflection is just not there. Like, she's... That sounded like she was taunting the girl on the phone. I, I don't know what the fuck is happening there. Um... Like, the only things I can think of how this was, like, able to release like this was because the, either the director didn't have a good grasp of, of um, English 
or he forced like the voice acting people to do it a certain way which doesn't didn't make sense which kind of goes into the first point i just made or like the actors themselves didn't like have like a 100 percent grasp of the uh, english language and then like the director let it go or something i don't know it's so weird it's so weird how this was like able to get through all the checks and like bounces you have in producing like voice acting stuff. It's fucking it blows my mind. God damn it. Okay, my controller disconnected. I have to be careful with that. Okay. So. That was just the first example. I need to turn that sound off. I'll I'll do that at some point. Sorry, you heard the windows noise. Um we're going to explore a little bit up here before we go down though cuz Opperman returned to a hometown. A bacterian extinction, volume two, the effects of the body and the mind. A lot of vibration going on. Uh, that was not the same book that I just looked at. No, don't do that. Yeah, that doesn't seem to be the same book. Huh, okay. <laughs> Whatever, game. That sound. Gonna be a spooky TV scare. There's too much stack to tell what's on. Aw. Hit it. Okay, destroy it. No, it's not happening. Let the reporter take care of doors. I don't like that, that I'm kind of like stuck waiting for doors to open. That kind of sucks. I like to explore and see all the, the stuff in here. Oh, look at Kit Kat. More blood, yep. Somebody must have been attacked or something. Gotcha. What do we have here? Let's take a look. Okay, that texture is unreadable. I... The... F four... Something? Okay. Cool, cool. The, the thing is, there can be so many, like, stuff... So many things... Tucked away that I would, like, just never see them. Because I do have a time limit, which kind of sucks. Last month's newspaper, the headline says, A uh, string of disappearances in Michigan. <laughs> Is that an alien? On Mega Quest? Hell. Newspaper from three months ago, a new strain of influenza rages through the area. Ooh. Sounds like somebody was experimenting with viruses. Hello. Okay, that's another Bacterian Extinction, Volume 3, Human Spread of Bacteria. Okay. I don't know why that has to be so, like, dramatic like that, but okay. Or anything? I think I already explored this room. Okay, I guess we're just continuing on. Can I, like, open these? Like, no. Alright. Let's go. Oh, I'm locked on. Oh, God. Go back. Hold on. Can I get her to open the... Hold on. Hold on. Will you come to the door? Let the reporter take care of doors. Yeah, yeah. I know. Okay, no. We have to go out. Damn it. Missing the secrets. Yep. Go ahead. Let's go. What a guy, that Briscoe. <laughs> As soon as he knows he won't be needed, he takes off. <laughs> I mean, that's kind of... yeah. Door won't open. Okay, so that one says it won't open. I guess that's just a door we'll never go through. Does that mean we could have went through the other ones? Blood is even splattered on the wall. Door won't open. Okay. So I, I think we actually missed doors, but I, I didn't really see a way to get them because she just autopiloted. I wonder if I'm missing buttons. No, the other ones don't seem to do anything. That sound. What is happening? I'm stuck. Get in. What the fuck is that? There's a doll there. It looks out of place. Why do I have white noise in my ear drums? There's nothing else to see, right? 
Shut up, reporter. Okay, there we go. It, like, got me stuck when I tried to examine that earlier. Can I... Okay, let's move away from the white noise generator over there. <laughs> That's actually fucking creepy. Oh, can I re-examine it? The doll is gone. Gosh. Okay. The door won't open. Okay. Let's. I, I'm guessing I can't interact with any of these doors. Unless they're like a jar or something. That's the elevators. Hold on, what's up over here? Seem like anything. Yeah, these doors won't open. Okay. I wonder if I could just randomly, like, touch, hit the doors and see if they open. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, they seem kind of like... Okay, whatever. Let's just keep going. Touch the button. Elevators seem to be working. Okay. Yeah, pretty obvious. She's in the elevator. Right. Oh, okay. <laughs> Scoop indicator at the top of the screen shows uh, what kind of scoops you've been focusing your attention on. The E on the left indicates erotic points, and the S on the right in indicates suspense points. Such a weird system, like... Someone... A group of people stood in a room and was like, Yeah, this is how the game is gonna go. Erotic and suspenseful. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Who's playing the piano? Gosh. Who is it? Oh, it's Briscoe. Briscoe. Got laughing. What are you doing? You're supposed to be working. Oh, damn. Damn. I can't play this song. <laughs> no, no. I mean, it's no use. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> it's a fucking mess. I just let Pamela die. I still can't believe it. Did it really happen? Yeah, I got Pamela it on video. You want to see it? <laughs> Again? What am I going to tell her parents? Briscoe? Hey, I know. I'll tell him. Pamela was a fine reporter and a brave one. She threw herself into her work. Yeah. Pamela was pretty brave, wasn't she? Hey, that was delivered I like perfectly. Loved but... her. <laughs> okay, I'm whoa. Let's go. Pamela. <laughs> Why is she up to? Damn it! Too much sauce. Didn't even get a chance to say goodbye. Risco, I understand how you feel. Remember, <laughs> Pamela and I. Why did you turn together. away from him? We were always friendly rivals. Look, I wish it didn't happen either. But, you know, danger is what this job's all about. After all. That's Pamela not knew the okay. danger she faced. After all, and I won't let Pamela die in vain. That's why. Going for her. Let's go out there and capture the truth. Briscoe, come on. We can't do it without you. Wrong. How is she? Yeah. 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 I guess you're right. Okay. Oh man! I gotta, I gotta sober up. Think you could find me some water? 
All right, not sure. gonna instantly sober up. You sound like you're fucking wasted. What? Oh, we're actually like finding water. All right, hold on. I want to explore a little bit. I got 31 minutes, lady. Oh, this is creepy in here. Oh. What am I doing? Dear D. I did some investigation, but I still. What is she running to? <laughs> the, the word Gagney it needs to be an important. or seems to be an important keyword from M. I missed like half of that. That text goes so fast. That might be because my, uh. my PS2 is running a little fast. <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> Definitely a PS2, um... Okay, interesting. What do we have here? Oh, God. Oh, that's... <laughs> Dead body. I'm on the wrong side of it, though. I just noticed, like, all the dead bodies kind of look the same. They're just, like... Models just in... Red. With, like, a red tint to them and stuff. Like, what exactly is happening to them that's causing them to just get sprayed in that much blood? God, is this the doll? Oh! It disappeared! And we got white noise over here, let's leave fast. Oh god, that's- oh, I'm so sensitive to like, white noise like that, that just fucking hurts, dude. Okay, let's go into the store, there doesn't seem to be anything else. Huge spotted spider. Got a ram and to save her. Oh god. Get out of the way, lady. <laughs> oh. What? Is she dead? I, I saved her. Anne? You can wake up now. Uh-oh. <laughs> Did I just fail? Oh my god, I just fucking failed. Oh no. Oh god. Damn it. Okay. Okay, so... If you're not familiar with this game, if you fail a mission like that, it skips forward to the next level. You don't go back, you don't, like, repeat. Like, for example, I can show you. I'm not gonna say it, because I, I, I actually want to do that int mission in its entirety. Um, no, don't. Yeah, cancel save, yes. I, I think you go to the next level. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Like, you get fucked over real hard if you fail something. Maybe I'm wrong? Daka TV, t a team log. Oh, maybe, maybe we didn't fail. Just repeat? No, 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 this is... We failed. Okay, okay, hold on. Who's... Who the fuck is that? Is that... Wait, is that the... Oh, that's a different lady. Okay. Okay, let's hold off. Hold off here. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and end it here. Um... Wait, so that's... A... What just happened? I'm so confused. Okay. So yeah, when when a person dies like that, or when a mission fails, we it, you get skipped to the next level and stuff. Um, I don't know who the hell this girl is, but we're not going to continue. I'm just going to end the episode here, and then we'll pick off where I left on the last one and try to ram her into safety, which I thought I did, but apparently, apparently I got to do the Briscoe ram and just fucking send her flying forward. But oh well. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah. We we finally got to see some of the some of the uh, perfect voice acting in this game. <laughs> oh, I'm happy about that, and I'm happy we're continuing on. But if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave a like and comment below. Um, if you want to see more of my stuff, go ahead and subscribe. I do do a lot of stuff like this. Usually the horror games aren't as wonky and as bad as this one, but well, I, I shouldn't even say bad. I love this game. It's like. I, I don't know what you would call it, but unique.
usually they're not as unique as this game, I would say. <laughs> uh, I'm Scarecrow J, and uh, thanks for watching. <laughs>